Hello everyone, my name is Manny and uh, today I'm going to show you how to connect this uh, SWM7805C uh, car radio to an external uh, TV box. I won't be using the uh, rear camera, I'll just connect this to a uh, TV box like uh, TV Plus or uh, GMA Afforda box. Well, I already connected it to a speaker and power supply now I'm gonna show you this is the pink wire and uh, this one should be tapped to the positive supply to be able to access the uh, camera input but in place of the camera you can uh, attach a uh, or you can connect a uh, TV box here okay so let me show you the back panel of this car radio unfortunately there are only four RCA jacks at the back this one is for the uh, rear camera input this is the only video input unfortunately it doesn't have the auxiliary video input like the other models like the uh, two DIN models is a single DIN model so there are only four this is for the camera rear camera input this one is for the uh, video output on the LCD uh, monitor whether you want to use a uh, 32 or 42 inch LCD TV there's only four playback mode of uh, videos with the uh, USB disk when you play video on the uh, from this uh, USB or on a TF card we're gonna connect this one to the external TV monitor or LCD monitor this two is only for the uh, audio output so there's no way you can use uh, simultaneously a video and audio in this uh, car radio okay so let me show you how you uh, how you connect those uh, sources and the uh, output uh, monitor first let me put this this is connected to a t uh, TV box right here when you connect the pink wire and the uh, positive supply together it's already showing the uh, output of the TV box okay without the TV box connected it's done it shows your camera so let's connect the TV box again there <laughs> okay before I forget uh, audio will not play here because we are on the camera mode unfortunately there's no audio for that we we need to attach this to an external speaker. You need to attach an external speaker in order to hear the audio coming from the uh, TV box. Is it connected? Yes. So, so video outputs and the audio outputs you need to, <laughs> to attach a powered speaker. There you go. So that's how you connect a video source. Okay, this is the original <coughs> camera that came with the product. So 
So let's connect it and I'm gonna show you. So you have to connect this to capacitive power supply and connect the output to the camera input here. Always remember that to be able to activate the camera input, like I'll show you, you always have to connect the pink wire to the positive supply. So, AUX camera or door camera will be powered. Okay. So, let's hook it up. Then, supply the power. Oops, sorry. There we go. Now let me show you the video output. I don't think I've uh, watched any video showing this functionality. So everybody's asking what is this camera out uh, video output is for well let me show you the video output only works with the uh, a player it's not working with the uh, tv box or camera input okay so again the output here is the lower rca jack this is the video output you can connect it, this to a tv a bigger LCD monitor like a 42 inch uh, television so you can watch uh, any video playing in here via the TF card or the uh, USB disk okay so when you connect a USB flash disk uh, playing videos here at the SWM 7905C car radio So it's playing in here. But you have to. This is the video output. But you can uh, choose whether to show the video here in a car video or to the external television. You can use a 42 inch uh, bigger LCD monitor to watch. Uh, <laughs> music videos or movies in here so just press this video output and it will show on the monitor see press it out again and it will show here there again press the Good on here. It's the external monitor. Wait. And it will show in here. There. Tap it once more and it will return to the monitor on the car radio. Press it. Press the external monitor on the car radio. There, it shows on the LCD screen, uh, on the external monitor. So that's how you connect a uh, external monitor on the SWM7905C. Unfortunately, it will only show in any of these two, either on the car radio or on the external LCD monitor. Furthermore, you can use the remote to skip or fast forward the video.
by using the remote you can uh, use all the functionality on the video mode unfortunately you can uh, you cannot do this uh, via the touch screen because when you tap this one it will return here the video will return here so okay. but when you when you're using the external LCD monitor you must use the uh, remote to fast forward, play or pause the video. Okay. The audio still uh, goes out from the car radio to your speakers connected in here okay so I can install a push button and switch here to activate the video input or the camera input on One should be soldered to the pink one. The other show a solder to the positive wire. Okay. The second. There you go. So when you switch this, it will switch to the camera mode. Again, let's connect the TV box. By the way, this is the uh, this is an ISDBT a TV uh, digital system we use here in the Philippines with the air TV okay. so let's connect it again where's the cord again okay, connect it on the top RCA yeah. The other one should be connected to the TV box video input right here. The input. Sorry. There. I'm using it uh, for home installation so I don't need the camera I don't need the rear camera uh, unless I, uh, I'm gonna use this as a CCTV camera well I'm gonna connect it here but right now I'll be just using it as a monitor so I can use this car radio either for my TV box uh, free to air TV or to my Android TV box. There, it's connected to my uh, Android TV box. Well, my purpose why I bought this uh, radio is for home installation. I only want the uh, monitor for uh, my uh, TV box. So, there you go. It's currently connected to my. Uh, Android TV. Uh, 
so let's play the video again if we're gonna be using this as a TV monitor we have to connect an external audio source to be able to hear the audio from the uh, TV box we are connecting or the, uh, the source because it doesn't have the audio it can't uh, play both the video and the uh, audio at the same time on a car radio that's the only catch to it but you can use this for the purpose of just a tiny uh, monitor Streaming live from the uh, smart TV box. And let's connect it to the uh, filter or TV box. The ISDB. Uh, ISDB box. And switch the audio to. There. Now it's connected. Now it's connected to my uh, ISDBT Twitter Air TV box. Switch it off. Connect it to the external one. connect a um, an external LCD monitor to this uh, SWM S7805C unfortunately it could only show video either here on an LCD monitor or here on a uh, car radio it cannot uh, show you simultaneously only here or either here I'm gonna press the I want to uh, show the uh, video to the external LCD monitor. We're gonna press the external monitor icon here. So we're gonna show here. Back once, and it will go back here. Again press the external monitor icon and show so that's how you connect an external LCD monitor to the SWM 7805C car radio kabanitan na kayan sang ayon ka na bang mabakunahan na ang mga kabataan sa harap ng lumulubong kaso ng COVID-19 sa di ng mas mabagsik na variant ng Corona o ng uh, coronavirus. Makibahagi sa ating balita na kayan ngayong Biyernes, September 3, 2021, 
Subaybayan ang balita lang kayo live streaming sa mga social media channels at pages sa Web25, Radio Angela at Eagle News Hub. Ako po si Wen Dalapuente. Tinataya ng Department of Health na papalo ng higit sa 43,000 ang kaso ng COVID-19 sa Metro Manila pagsapit ng katapusan ng Setyembre. Sa statement, sinabi ng DOH na batay sa assumptions, ang arawang kaso sa NCR para sa Setyembre at 30 ay aabot mula 16,000 hanggang 43,000. Konsiderasyon sa projections ang mobility, healthcare capacities at ang pagsunod ng publiko sa minimum health protocols. Pero paliwanag ng DOH na batay sa mga numerong ito, ginagamit ng kagawaran na gabay para higit na mapagbuti ang paghahanda sa pandemic response pangunahin na sa banta ng mas nakakahawang Delta variant na ngayon ay nasumpungan na sa lahat ng reyon ng Pilipinas. Tumalo na sa may git dalawang milyon ang cumulative number of cases ng COVID-19 at naunang ibinabala ng COMELEC o ng DOH na magpipik ang kaso sa kalagitnaan ng Setyembre. So that's how you connect an external uh, LCD monitor and uh, attach a, uh, an uh, auxiliary uh, video input like a TV box or a smart Android TV. Any source, uh, VHS, or anything, okay? That's so how you connect it here at the SWN 7805C. I guess that's it for today. Uh, I hope you liked the video, and thanks for watching. Goodbye.